Hi everyone, uh, Paul here. Um, it's currently 20 past 11 in the evening on Monday the 17th of, um, of November. Um, it's actually about 5pm Tuesday, Brisbane time. Um, I just thought I'd do this little video blog to um, let you know, I guess, keep you up, keep you in the loop about what's happening. Um, yeah, I just spent the last five hours of sleep, well, on and off of sleep. I'm trying to get over this jet lag. It's just really playing havoc, and you probably noticed in the earlier clip when I was walking around over new CBS TV that I just looked absolutely haggard. Um, probably still do a little bit now. I just definitely need a shower. I was just so exhausted before, but um, yeah, I just thought I'd um, do this little video blog to sort of keep you in the loop and let you know what's happening. I might get rid of those glasses. They're probably reflecting the light. Um, yeah, pretty tight at the moment, um, yeah, trying to get over this jet lag, um, probably not doing it very successfully, but uh, a couple of days I'll be right again, but um, yeah, being so tired and um, this place, I'll tell you what, if you've never been to LA and walked around, it's a very, very daunting place, um, it can be quite intimidating, I don't know why, it just, LA just has a different feel and different atmosphere than, say, Toowoomba or, or even any capital city in Australia, like Brisbane, Melbourne, Sydney or whatever. Uh, it just has a completely different feel. I can't really put my finger on it. Um, it's a completely different planet over here. Uh, the people are so different. Um, like, I'm just in this... I had to book into this motel. Um, they wanted $70 a night or $350 for the week. It's probably going to take me close to a week to get over this jet lag. So I thought I'd bit the bullet and just say, oh, 300, I'll, I'll stay a week. Um, money is extremely tight at the moment. Um, probably you might, if you've read my Facebook post from yesterday or today or whatever, you know, depending on what part of the world you're in, um, the exchange rate for the for the Australian dollar is 72 US cents, which is extremely low. Put it this way, um, I exchanged $900 that got me 600 US. Um, yeah, there's half, just over half of the first week's um, motel bill as it is. Um, and I found another $40 in my wallet, which I exchanged, and that gave me 26 US dollars. Um, yeah, very poor rate. Um, probably a little bit worried that, well, I'm pretty sure that the money's not going to last very long at all. Um, yeah, I've pretty chewed through most of it. Um, this motel room, I don't know if you can have a look. This is where I'm staying. Um, smells of stale cigarette smoke, but you get these sort of divey little motels all around LA. Are pretty this is pretty typical of what they're like here, you know. There's a bit of a kitchen set up there. Um, at least I've got a reverse cycle air con. There you go. However, I do not have a fridge. I do not have a kettle. This kettle here, I had to buy it myself yesterday, $17 at uh, a Rite Aid store. Um, yeah, just made coffee. I've got no fridge, so my milk has to sit out there. Um, oh, put my hand in the way. Yeah, so there's there's my kettle. I just made myself a coffee because I need something. I'm just, yeah, <laughs> although it's probably not a good idea to drink coffee this time of night. Um, I, however, did bring some coffee from Australia. Got to have my Macona. And also, too, I brought a jar of Vegemite, which is probably somewhere in here, buried. Here it is. You've got to have this when you're in America. The good old Vegemite. <laughs> I bought a tiny little jar, the very smallest jar you, you could get. Uh, last time I was here, that cost me seven US dollars. So that's probably about a hundred dollars Australian. Uh, that cost me seven dollars in Toowoomba. And you've got to have it. Stable diet. Every Aussie's got to bring Vegemite with them. And Customs didn't mind either. They didn't mind the coffee or anything, which I was quite surprised. I thought they might have picked on it, but they didn't. Okay, this is kind of my room. I'll give you a quick view. 